Alright, hello everyone, this is Issa, welcome back to Yomawari. We're starting off, I just loaded the game up, so here we are starting up chapter 2 again with uh, Yui here. I'm doing this in the dark again because I hate myself and I like to blind myself with the menu, but... Um, last time we were playing with Haru, I believe, the blue ribbon girl. And we just went back home, you know how to take a giant detour. I probably yelled at the menu about seven times because it blinded me and I probably only really got scared once and I stayed silent instead of screaming so it's it's a great mix. I'm great at horror games. Alright so anyways where am I? Oh where am I? Ba -ba -bum. Well we don't have a torch so this is the best part. I was I was chased by something on the mountain and you somehow ended up here and then what happened? The real question is, where the hell is this? In any case, I should head home. Alright, so another reminder that um, I'm pre-recording all of this, so... If you want to spoil anything, that's fine, because I would have already gone through the whole game. If you want to yell at me for missing things, that's fine too, because I've already finished the whole game and I will be able to go back through it. Um, but, it seems like... They're going to be gentle on us for now and actually just let us walk because we don't have a flashlight to actually defend ourselves. The most we can do is get in the bush. So, you know. Alright, uh, can I open a... What's your with the map? That. Go home. E, B, C, D. Glorious. What open mean? Alright, so basically I don't have a map. Right. I'm presuming I don't have a map, so... That's the best part. Alright, so... I got a stone! Cool. And I can't see it sparkling on the ground even though I don't know why stone sparkles when you shine a light on it. Because I don't have a torch. Hello! Lots of uh, ripped up... What do these look like? Election papers? Posters? What's this? It's a torn magazine. The pages are scattered around. I'll try reading some of it. Great time to be doing this. If you run into it, Hands, feet, and neck. Give them. Well, isn't that ominous? Not the time to be reading this. I wonder what this is about. Are those the only parts you can read, or is it just, um... Oh, whoops. Or is it just the parts that... Uh... Are readable. Are still legible. Was it actually the article? Alright, well anyways, uh, I guess we go this way. Hello crows, how you doing? I was gonna say, it was like, well you're not gonna get out of my way. Uh, do we go towards the house? We should be going into the houses, right? Oh, the worst part right now is we don't actually have a map. Um, so... We just kinda have to walk and hope for the best. It's a good thing that, um... Your character can kind of detect if something's close to you, you can go examine it. Because uh, that helps, especially since I don't have a torch. A torch basically does everything for you in this game, so... Uh, where the hell am I going? I mean, I still don't know where I ended up, which is a thing. I don't know the map yet either, which is also a problem. Uh, I'm presuming there's something in the, one of these trash bags, right? No? We're not going to find something in one of these trash bags this time? Hello, broken doll. I'm you Omnius. For a night like this. And we're next to the river. Cool. Where the hell am I? I still don't know where the hell I am. They're basically waiting to um, jump scare me, right? The bigger joke is that they're waiting to jump scare me, but I went the wrong way, so. Um. Where the hell am I? Ah, it's beating. Why is my heart beating? What's happening? Why did I get so scared at that point? I'm walking past a graveyard. In what way was this a good idea? It's a crow. It looks dead. Well, you know, when it's flat on the ground and it's own blood like that, it probably shouldn't look dead. Oh great, now there's a skid mark as well. What happened to this thing? Did it get run over? That's a dip. 
Wait, what? What was that? This way? This way? This way? This way? Here we go. Got a stone! Perfect. Hmm. Random sounds. Another blood splat. That's a lot of crows, man. A lot of crows got taken out. Hello. What are you? A note? I'll try reading some of it. It's a risk of it covered in blood and you can't read it, or you just got a note that doesn't really say anything. It's coming closer. Help. Help me. I can't take any more. Someone. Glorious. Well, isn't that, um... Kind of just telling us exactly what's about to happen. Oh, that's a hand now, isn't it? This. You gave up a hand and you're still turning into blood explosions on the ground, so... It looks real. That's because it probably is. Are we going to find a body? Hello. If you'll excuse me, I'll go... Oh, never mind. We're getting behind the sign because, you know, when you're only half hidden behind the sign, nothing can find you. You blind as hell. Alright, we can come out now. Glorious. Now we've got something that wants arms and legs running around. Cool. Save has been completed. Cool. So it was like... Cause I think Haru is supposed to be the one you're playing most of the time because uh, the trailer at least has um, I'll bring Yui home as like the main message so I'm presuming Yui doesn't really get to do much apart from get wrecked. I haven't seen Yui since. No you haven't. But you have the torch so you gotta go do things. I wonder if she's not home yet. You have a nice house, by the way. So what can I... I know. I'll take that charm that I found. That charm might protect me from the spirits. What charm? The really dodgy one? Let's pick a charm to take. Wow, I get to pick one in one. <laughs> Wait, so I can either wear my ribbon or I get to carry extra pebbles. Because the pebbles will definitely save me. Uh, technically it does in a way, because um... You can make things go after the sounds, because you know how games work. Hey, distract them by throwing that rock over there. Oh, I wonder where that rock came from. Pick this. A chewed up charm I got from a dog. It has some black hairs on it. It's really worn out. Yeah, man, this will definitely protect you. I like how your default's a ribbon, and then you don't... Wait, what can I do here? Maybe I just rest a little. I presume that's a save. So... I have the flashlight, right? How do I turn the flashlight on? I guess I can't turn it on until I'm downstairs. Or and outside. Wait, how's your house structured? I'm gonna presume there's supposed to be a room to my um, immediate left side here. Or well, Haru's left side here, because otherwise your room is floating in mid -air. Go look for Yui? Yeah, sure, why not? And because this is a game, and people have bright ideas, we're out here at night. But that's definitely a good idea. Can we take a bike? Can we just bike around? No. Alright, well, anyways, uh, we need to go look for Yui. We have no instructions on where to go, which is the best. Hello, dog. We now have instructions on where to go, so let's go follow the dog. I presume we're supposed to follow the dog. Which way did it go? Oh, here we go. Hello, hello dog. What do you want? Yo, yo, he's dog. Great. Can you lead us to her by smell or something along those lines? Just as a um, side note, a dog is usually isn't capable of something like that. A dog has to be trained to be actually able to lead you by smell, generally speaking. It's gone. This has Yui's picture on it. Is she dead as hell? What does the article say? Elementary school girl gone missing. What else, quick? Call it, you have information? Question mark. It's like, if you have information, maybe you should call, maybe you shouldn't. I don't know why it was phrased in the question. 
Something like that. So she's been gone for a day. And she's already missing. Yui is really gone. I have to find her. Even though something with scissors just basically tried to take her out, so... Alright, dog, where did you go? Hey, look, we can see something because we have a torch. What is it? Oh. Right. Well, anyways. Alright, so where are we actually going? We're going towards the bridge and the apartments and then the train tracks. I wonder if each piece of paper represents its own uh, section. Because uh, the, uh, the interesting thing about the previous game was that each um, chapter took part in its own area. I genuinely got really pissed at the um, factory part, but that's because I died at the same spot about 50 times. Alright. Oh yeah, is, is there a friendly ghost in here this time? No? Wait, where's that question mark leading me? Whoa, shit. I just took someone's trash, don't worry about it. Someone threw away good old cash. Ha! Huh. Hello, scissor man. I presume I don't want to walk towards you, genuinely speaking. But I think I have to. Alright, well, let's walk towards this hand. Uh, how do I... Yeah. Yes, this hand, you're not gonna do anything about me? Good. Wait, what's this? It's a dirty flyer. It looks handmade. Oh, there's also a, um... Stick man there. Looking for information about the light that fell. Hmm. That's what's written on it. Cool. Oh great, the dead end. Can I go into these apartments? No? Well hello, uh... Uh, may you... Can you like not come towards me like this, thanks? Alright, you'll excuse me, I'm just gonna walk away. I'm not too sure I managed to juke around that, but... I'll take it. Alright, so that one's still there, but Scissor Man is no longer here, so I guess we go this way. Alright, what... How about you don't come towards me while I'm moaning? But that's just creepy. Oh good, it's a Jesus statue. Alright, what I'm gonna do right here is save. Give a coin to Jesus statue so I can save. Open a coin. Save has been completed. And, oh yeah, you can quick travel with Jesus statues. How that works, I'm not too sure. I've never been to Japan and I'm not too sure how Jesus statues work in general, but apparently they allow you to teleport from one to the other. It's a poster for an exhibit. There's some weird clay dolls printed on it. You mean like those Jesus statues right there? Alright, where am I now? There's some stairs that I presume it leads back up to the top, closer to where my house is. I can't cross the bridge because that's blocked off. You can actually see the barricade in her drawing here. Uh, I presume I'm supposed to go towards the apartments. That makes the most sense. Because it's like an actual area, per se. Is there another flyer? There are some words written mostly on the sign. It says, Danger! Road closed! You mean this road? Am I gonna get tackled by something if I- Uh... Lady, that's not how you commit suicide. You're still very alive and that's a slight issue. Well, that was amusing. It's just like, Let me get Ah! Bleh, ah! Ah! It hurts! But I didn't die! Ah! I probably should have been more scared by that, but it's kind of hard to be when it's so comical the way the flame went out. Uh, Willow Wiz, what the hell do you want from me? How about you don't do that? Are you really gonna sit on my face like this? My god, this is bright. Okay, I guess you're not supposed to hide from this thing. Alright, I'm gonna pop out and probably explode, so, um... Oh, hi, that's a lot of will o -wisp. Oh, hello, you're the Moaning Man, so... Actually, will o -wisp lets you to hurt me. But the Moaning Man probably does, so... 
A more weight than one. Yes, I just made a sexual joke. Uh, hmm, I probably should have walked towards you, so let's go this way. Oh, hello! Oh, you actually move kind of fast. Oh, that's a, that's not like that. Oh, no, wait, nope, you're the same as my walking speed, don't worry. Hello, running person. What are you doing? I presume you turn around and come back. Cool. Alright. A stone. And a bush, of course. So, can we go behind that person that was just blocking the way now? Alright, well, I'm not too sure what you find so fancy about the exact spot, but I'm gonna walk past you now. Uh. Well, there's something there, so let's go this way. What is that? Oh. Uh, that's a big mouse sticking on the ground. I'm presuming the game should be pretty gentle at this point. It does get pretty complex after all. Oh. It does get genuinely kind of complex after a while. So. Uh, I don't know. Um, do I really have to sneak past you? Are you. Wait, no, did you disappear? Oh, thank you. Thank you for clearing the way. There's a blockade here, so I had to go this way. Puzzle 2 found. Oh, there's a dude in. Not too sure why you despawned, but that's very convenient for me, because I was... This is this thing again, right? What is this thing? I can't really tell what this thing is. Oh, alright, hold on. Let me just close my eyes and open a menu. Oh... Oh wait, no, not this menu. Duh. This menu! Okay, don't look at it as it opens. Oh, that's bright. Uh... Wait, what do paper planes do? Um, it flies better if you don't throw it as hard. But I don't know what this does. I mean, I know stones make a sound and things um run towards it. Hmm. Alright, well, anyways. Let's go back down and keep going... Wait. I'm just going around circles at this point, aren't I? Maybe I need to go up the other staircase and go around. Because I can't go past that guy. I just do a big loop. I did just do a big loop. Oh, well, that's all good. I can't save without offering a coin. But how much coins? Uh, how many coins do I have right? Uh, that's good, right? No, it's not. Not bad this time. Uh, how many coins do I have? I can't tell. Great. Um. I have nine. I have nine coins. All right, well, let's just save again. Save has been completed. Teleport? Not right now, but we're gonna walk up this way. Okay. Hello, sparkly thing on the ground. Uh, excuse me, why are you behind me? What is it? Hmm. Well, I wasn't too sure what I was supposed to do there. I don't know if I could actually juke around it. Also, I can get unlimited coins from dying, so that's also a thing. Can I juke around that thing? I actually don't know. Well, I actually don't need to come up here, which is also a thing. Alright, well, first if The most anticlimactic one of no panic at all. Because it was just like, oh, hmm, this place blocked. I just accepted it. <laughs> uh, I fully just accepted it. <laughs> so, hmm, this place blocked. Well, that's a problem. I can't do anything about this, can I? Yeah, I presume I can't do anything about that. So I'm not going to go that way. Uh, is Mr. Running Man here again? No? Oh hi, Running Man is here. I'm uh, presuming he tackles me if he runs into me, so I'm just going to stay out of... You're not going to come back this way? Alright then. Oh no, you're still there. What are you doing? You're running into the wall there. I don't think running to a wall is particularly great exercise, but... Alright, let's just try and shoot. Hello, what are you doing? Oh wait, there's no bomb. Can I go around here? Okay, cool. Alright, you, how about you stop chasing me now? Oh, I can't even do that off anymore. 
But there's a murdering man down there. Oh, there's something else up here. I don't think I need to be here. You used hand warmer found. Oh! Uh, a hand warmer that someone uses. And so it's called now. The warning on it says burn warning. Great. I have no idea what I used that for. A lot of items are actually used for side quests, at least in the previous game, so... Uh... Alright, so we're gonna try and get past that round ball thingy again, then go down to, to the bottom left, and then take a left on that turn to go down to that intersection, and then go down from there. Because that's basically all the places I can go to right now, so juke around this asshole, if he's here. He's not here anymore. Um, Alright, where are we now? Alright, go down this road. Oh yeah! Right. The road. I wonder if I'm going to get tackled again in this game. In the previous game, there was this gloriously hilarious thing where you basically get road killed because um, there's this basically sprinting guy that spawns behind you, I think, and runs directly at you, and you just have to kind of juke around him, and it's hilarious because he literally just tackles you. It's like, oh, road kill! At least I find it hilarious. I don't know why I find it hilarious, but... That's all the deaths that you can have, that's one of the funnier ones. Alright, so I guess we go this way. Um, this a... Oh, wow, I'm not supposed to go this way, apparently. Oh, especially when you get road killed, so... Um, anyways. Uh, is there a path down this way? I think there is. Alright, crows. A couple of you lost squished, but I presume you're gonna get out of I think it's the kid of Willow was behind me. Is anything else gonna annoy me? Or can I- oh yeah, I'm actually crossing the bridge now, aren't I? Huh, interesting. I'd actually like to be on the road and not on the road. Like, on the path. Hello, train. Are you- is it actually a train or is it just, like, permanently going off? I guess this is just permanently going off. Alright, so let's see, we're gonna go up the other way. Uh, <laughs> you know, this is why I played the previous game of a guide. So I didn't end up doing this. I'm gonna walk all the way back up the other side of the road. See if anything else tries to um, murder my face. Because that's always interesting. Um, the Will of Wars don't seem to actually harm me, so... If they, if they sit on top of my face, I think I'm actually okay. What? What do you want? I like how that's my response to um, my happy going up. It's like, what? What do you want? <laughs> oh, hi, Roku. Alright, that's basically what I was talking about. The <laughs> glorious Roku. Uh, guys. <laughs> He's still in the game, that's so good. Well, I mean, it's a different version of him, but it's still the same idea. <laughs> he basically just runs you over, and it's the funniest thing ever. Oh, great. Ah, oh, jeez. Uh, you get attacked by a spirit, throw a rock or something, and run away when it's distracted. If you meet a spirit, you have to walk slowly so it won't notice you. Yeah, well, generally speaking, you walk all the time. Okay, so we're going around that, um, spot. Girl, you just saw something drive down the road. Why are you walking the road now? A scrap of paper on the ground. Now pick it up and walk back to the pavement before you read it. This was written in a hurry. I can't read it because of the stain. Yeah, something on the back. What is on the back? Mr. Kotowari. Hands and feet a neck give. Cool. Mr. Kotowari? What does that mean? Is that the name of the ghost? Scribbled note found. And, oh, Jesus, this is so bright. Missy handwriting on the paper that's been cut to pieces. It says give it hands, legs, and neck. So I presume that's Mr. Scissor Hands. Oh, hey, save point. Yes. No. Alrighty. So do we go back up towards home or do we keep going down? Let's try going up towards home first. Uh, we can always use the Jesus statue to warp our way around the place because that's how Jesus statues work in real life as well. It's a poster. The damn reservoir is low. Please conserve water. I think we've walked past this one before. That's what it says. No, we haven't. We haven't come through this part. Hello, dog. If you excuse me, I'm gonna go this way. Why is my heart still beating? What's over here? Oh, hi, it's Mr. Scissorhands. 
Are you gonna come back down the road, or you just gotta go up that way? Alright, well, you went up that way, so I presume I'm supposed to go this way to avoid you. But I don't feel like giving you my arms or my legs, because I'll probably die because um, I'm missing one of those. It's they're very important to my survival, so. <laughs> Let me just walk straight through someone's front yard. Well, it's not really much of a front yard, Japanese homes, especially these cars. Hello! Hey, you excuse me, I'm gonna go this way now. Alright, tentacles. Girls and tentacles don't mix, you know where that's gonna end up going. Yes, I just made another sex joke. Um, but. Oh, hello. Alright, what am I scared of? What do I need to know about? Oh, wait, there you are. Okay, we'll go through. We'll go straight past it. I know that you're dead, now stop moaning. They cut me off. Fan freaking tastic. All right, well, uh, we're just gonna straight up the road this time, dude. How about that? Oh yeah, I can't go straight up the road. Um, wait, is there a bush there that I can hide in? No, there isn't. Good boy, Fitch. Didn't know that would work. I just pressed the wrong button because I actually wanted to select the item, but instead I just used it. I'm walking towards something. That's just rude. People put their mail in there. You're just fondling it all up. Another coin. I have too many of these. Okay. That was a little bit unexpected. He's dead, Jim. Who the hell is Jim? Doggy, are you back? After not leading me anywhere and I had to do it myself? The best joke is that the dog was the other way. Isn't it? Hello, Ken. I made noise, that is never a good sign in a horror game. Another coin, why do I have so many of these? Alright dog, where the hell are you? Uh, hello running man, could you like not do that please? Whoosh! Ah, fuck. Unfortunately this girl does not run very fast, but the dog was that way, so I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to go that way. You were a coin, weren't you? Yeah. Is the dog back? Alright, bitch! Good job. Alright, now run straight to the bush this time. Is there something in there? Perhaps start speeding faster than I walk towards it. You're not gonna freak out this time, little box? Okay. Another coin? What about you, garbage bag? You're not gonna freak out. You're gonna freak out. Okay. Um. I got to hear the dog. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna go this way. Go towards home. So I'm. Wait, I'm behind my house now, aren't I? No, I just looped around. Where's my house? It's on the other side of this. It's down the hill, isn't it? Alright, well, anyways. Yes. Alright, so this time let's not be an idiot and run straight to the bush. After running man starts charging towards us. I presume he runs past us and not just sits on the bush like the will o -Wisp does. Ba -la -ba 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 -la -ba -ba Wait! Well, that was quick. Alright, let's just wait for us to have to restore. All right, dick. <laughs> uh, on the north side of this town, there's a haunted mansion. Everyone who lived there, the rest is ripped. I presume they all died, because you know that's pretty for a horror game, right? All right, so we're going just we're going towards the graveyard. This could only end well now, can't it? 
It's out this way. This is a graveyard. This is this is Nope, that pop's blocked. Uh there's a stop sign here, I'm gonna get road killed again. Oh uh, wait, is this blocked? There's two barricades, but not a third one, so I can walk straight through the middle. Glorious. Alright, we're going towards the graveyard. What the hell was that? Huh. Oh no, someone's hand got chopped off. Oh, hi, it was just the hands. Alright, well, anyways. Am I supposed to just like. Oop. Right, it's like the boss thing from last time. Run each time he's like rearing up. There's no point to run otherwise, but you just catch up. Oh, hi. That was a. Alright, we're now at the graveyard. So I presume we have to go into the graveyard. Ah, uh, hi, Blood. Oh, hi, you're back. And how long are you gonna keep chasing me for? Ah, and you're back again. Oh, cool. Okay, so when you raise up and doesn't do anything for all, like, that's when he just charges at you. Did you like piss off at some point? Oh, I'll take that. Nope. Oh, never mind. Oh, hi, the doll's on the ground now. Are you. Oh. I was supposed to pick that up. I totally was, wasn't I? Alright, give me Can I get past you? Thank you. Oh. Can you like piss off slightly so I can get to that wall? I think I um shoot him again. Someone open space! Oh I'll put you to that move. Alright, um what up? Okay, never mind. We're in a slightly narrow road now. Um, this is like. Okay. Alright, well. Successful joke. Alright, we need to pick up the doll. There's the only thing we can enter out with, so that's our only choice. Yeah, you do that. Stay back. Oh, for frick's sake. If you could stop coming after me with sharp objects, that would be very nice. I'm not too sure why your scissors are painted red with some kind of coating. Well, I'm kidding, of course I know. Okay. Alright, doll, you better do something. But that's how ghosts work. Cool. Well, that thing just got sliced up, I think. And that doll. What happened to that doll? I picked up stuffed doll's right arm. We gave it an arm. So apparently we're fine now. That spirit is gone. After chopping off an arm. I was so scared. No shit you were. Yui. Is Yui okay? Where? Where did she go? This place is so scary. I have to hurry. I have to hurry and find her. Good determination. Now you're going home. Right. Then we go jump over the Yui again before we jump back to Haru. Oh, that's bright. Yui is missing. I wonder where Yui is. I can't find her. For some reason, I feel like Yui is calling me. I'm going to go look around the town. And at night to look for her again. Alright, so problem number one is, why are you looking for her at night? Well, it's the same as last game. For some reason, 
these girls have some obsession with looking for people during the night time. Alright, well, anyways. Would you like to save? Yes. Alright, well, I think that'll do it for this episode of Yamawari Midnight Shadows. It's back to Yui again, but we're going to ignore that for now. Um, well, there's not really much else to say. We're just going to keep going with the story and see how this mystery unfolds. If the biggest mystery in the end is that the scene at the start where um, Yui hung herself was real and this Yui is a ghost, that would be the biggest uh, plot twist now, wouldn't it? Alright, well, anyways, that'll be it for this episode of Yomori Midnight Shadows. You know, follow along with the rest of the series. Remember, subscribe. Thanks for watching, and till next time.